the caravan, three and a half thousand pounds. Setting the seal on a week of great show jumping entertainment, starting with the Butlin Championship. With only four of our 16 international riders in Mexico, the Horse of the Year show produced a host of talent. This is Peter Robeson on Firecrest. But the championship winner is a 24-year-old girl from Cheshire, Jean Goodwin and all trumps. Going last in the jump off, she beat Germany's Tokyo bronze medal winner with a faultless round, finishing just 1.4 seconds ahead. Princess Margaret presented the trophy. But she wasn't the only princess in the arena. The next night, her niece, Princess Anne, was taking part in a quadrille open to pony clubs all over Britain. Her team from Battle in Sussex was one of only four to qualify for the finals. The princess was riding Man Friday, lent to her by one of her school friends. So, back to the show jumping, and among British riders in the Will's Gold Plate, Alan Oliver and Sweep, failing to sweep clean. The wall caused many a downfall. Top of the morning bids his rider good night. Andrew Fielder, riding Dixieland, comes off little better. Second place in the event went to Germany's Sonke Sonkesen on Fabus. Although they faulted in the final jump off, they sailed over the wall. But the prize went to Warwickshire farmer Ted Edgar and Uncle Max, a pretty rare combination. This huge grey used to be an American rodeo performer and Ted bought him only last month. Hard to reconcile rodeos with show jumping, but Ted Edgar and Uncle Max are obviously a tremendous partnership. Not far from Albert Bridge, on a bomb 